this is a demonstration of the Art Pink tool in NetScan Tools Pro 11. You locate it by going to Manual Tools, then selecting Art Ping. Art Ping is going to send an Art Packet to the IP address that you specify here. So I could specify anything I want within my subnet because Art Packets are not routed. They won't go beyond our subnet. So we're going to send it, and we've said to send 16 by default, but we'll do 8 for the purposes of this demonstration. They're going out this Win PCAP interface, and this is the timing between each packet that we send. I'm going to send a broadcast ARP, and then if it responds correctly, it will, will continue to send unicast ARPs, which mean that we're sending it to the specific MAC address of the IP address we targeted. So there's the first one that went to the broadcast address, which is the MAC address all Fs. And then it went to this specific MAC address beyond that. And as you can see, you can see the timing here. Because it's much like a ping function, you end up with the timing just like in ping. Now that we've done a standard R ping, there's another mode in the ARP ping tool where we search for duplicate IP addresses. In this selection right here, you can put either zeros for the source IP or the interface IP address, which is this, for the source IP address. Your destination remains the same. So if there were two computers with the same IP address, they would both respond with different MAC addresses here. So I'm sending it out, and I do know that we do not happen to have a second computer with the same IP address, so in reality all we end up with is the one response. If there were a second one with the same IP address, this other MAC address would show here with the same IP address. That's the duplicate IP address search feature.